Welcome to Patents TV Featured Solutions. I'm David Jackson with the Patents Project. Today, I'm introducing John Sajak, the International Training and Accounts Manager for the Attainment Company. The Attainment Company produces an affordable line of products for students with intellectual disabilities or autism, including research-based literacy, math, and science curricular resources, as well as a variety of augmentative communication devices. You can explore these products and more by visiting their website at www.attainmentcompany.com. That's spelled www.attainmentcompany.com. If you have any questions, please reach out to John by email at john at attainmentcompany.com. That's spelled J-O-H-N at A-T-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T-C-O-M-P-A-N-Y.com. Please enjoy John's short video highlighting the benefits of their all-access web-based software solution. Hello, everybody. My name is John Sajak, and I'm going to give you a short presentation on Attainment's new web-based uh, software solution for individuals with disabilities. Um, if you are familiar with Attainment Company, you know that all of our curriculum come with uh, PDF files of the student materials. Uh, we provided that with an, in a CD format. However, as you also know, computers are no longer equipped with a CD. So instead of the PDFs provided in that particular manner, Attainment Company created a new website referred to as Attainment Hub, in which your PDF files are going to be provided but also any web-based content for our software programs. To begin um, and to find us, you can simply type in your web browser, hub, H-U-B dot attainment company, that's A-T-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T, -E company is fully spelled dot com. That is going to take you ultimately to our login page. The benefit of a login page and having a, an account um, through Attainment Hub is that your purchase as well as any future purchases would always be accessible to you at any particular time. Find your Attainment curriculum, a little drop down arrow here to drop down ultimately all of the files that are provided in there. And you'll be able to download those PDF files to your computer. As always, you do have a classroom license to be able to reprint those materials as often as you like for the classroom in which, in which it was purchased, as well as share any of those materials with your students virtually. For the purposes of today's presentation, I'm gonna be focusing on our web-based software. The web-based software will be accessed through Attainment Hub, but instead of the My Product section, you're going to go to the Cloud Management section. The benefit about attainments uh, web-based solutions is that you can access our software programs through any device, whether it be a Windows or Mac-based computer, an app supporting tablet such as an iPad or a Chromebook. Um, the students can access the content at home. They can access it from school. They can access the content from any other environment. The subscription is based on a per teacher account but for each particular teacher, the program will support up to 20 students. After you log into a Attainment Hub, you can begin by adding in the students underneath your caseload. Simple by adding add, we add the student's name. And from there, we begin to create an avatar that maybe most represents that particular student. The avatar, much like in computer games, can be changed um, within the settings so that we edit the avatar to look a little bit more exact as to how that individual looks. We can change the eyebrows. We can add in some different clothing options or as they would like to be represented. If you have multiple programs you can assign the specific program that you would like or multiple programs to that particular student by simply clicking on the particular curriculum that you would like. For example, the Early Literacy Skills Builder for older students. 
Off to the right here, you see the log in or home use, a username and password that is randomly generated by Attainment Hub. You will always have access to that username and password. However, you can also email that information specifically to a parent's home email so that that student can then access um, the software program from their device. From your login screen, depending upon the curriculum, you will also be able to choose the level that you want the student to off with if applicable to that program. Some programs will have levels to them and other programs will not. The settings also can be adjusted um, for that particular student through your account, specifically having to do with any scanning options. If your student does use switches to access content, you can go ahead and adjust those settings through your account at Attainment Hub. Once you have created the student account, adjusted any settings, and potentially sent that information over to the parent email, the student will then receive that information and they will then be able to log to the Attainment Hub and access the programs that have been assigned to them through the student desk. You can also ask access the student desk through your account. So to show you what it looks like from here, I'm gonna go ahead and hit that student desk. The student will see this. So far we have simply um, identified dollars and cents is going to be the program that they are going to be working on. But again, you can also um, assign them additional programs if you also have access to those. The student would simply then click on that particular software program, and then it would launch them into um, dollars and cents to be able to work on as a sign. Get back into what the teacher will see. You can go into the reports section there and see the specific results for how the student is progressing within that assigned program. Um, it will create a, a beautifully laid out graph for you was working on that particular program, and again, how much progress has been made within that program. Attainment Company currently has 11 software-based programs that are now accessible as well in a web-based format. Currently, I'm showing you a little bit of information about our web-based software subscription. We currently have a total of 11, as mentioned. Most of our programs begin at $60 for a one-year subscription to $70. Access language arts, number sense, show me math, math skills builder as some examples starting off at one year for $60. We also have three year subscriptions for $119. Our recent research based programs for students with moderate to significant disabilities, the early literacy skills builder, the ELSB for older students, as well as the early reading skills builder are each available at $150 for a one-year subscription or $299 for a three-year subscription. And again, that will support up to 20 students within your classroom. If you'd like to bundle some different software options together, we do have a math software solution. It includes the math skills builder, show me math, dollars and cents and number cents. We also have our literacy software solution, which bundles our literacy and reading programs. And we have our all access software solution. All 11 programs, a one year subscription, 899, a three year subscription for $1,499. If you decided to purchase the all access software solution, we provide separate access codes for each one of the programs and the access codes can be given to um, different teachers that would be working with different programs for their students. Having uh, a web-based option for students in today's world where students may be at home or in other environments is certainly a great way to continue to access um, attainment curriculum and software, but do it from anywhere at any time. And I'm happy to help out in any manner. If you'd like to receive a complimentary 30-day uh, trial of any of our web-based subscriptions, 
please feel free to email me. You can reach John at john at attainmentcompany.com. That's J-O-H-N at A-T-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T-C-O-M-P-A-N-Y dot com. Be sure to check out their website at Attainment Company. That's A-T-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T. Company is fully spelled dot com. Thanks for watching us today. You can follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and patentsproject.org. That's spelled P-A-T-I-N-S project.org.